Okay, Encore. One more discovery, right? I think this is how this works. So while we're trying to figure out breaking and cracking the code, the fight is on 213. So look at this, 213. Sorry for the, all the crazy uploads. I'll keep it short. But my last video, I was talking about 157 and 58 measuring from the birthday. You get a span of 58 days. When you take away this, uh, the end date, you get 157. Now look at this. The fight, UFC 258, is on February 13th, 213. And again, look at these numbers. Clear as day. So, no doubt in my mind, I'm, I'm going with Gilbert Burns, man. It's, there's just no way, man. There's no way. These key words, man. I don't know, guys. I don't know. Crazy stuff, right? Crazy stuff. We did see this in the last video, 223. I was talking about measuring from uh, somebody's birthday and it being 223. Yeah, here it is. <laughs> Look at this shit. 22 weeks, 3 days. 223 is the 48th prime number, though. February 13th, 223. <laughs> Yo, look at this shit. February 13th is 1229 in the Jewish cipher. Oh, my God. 1229 is the 201st prime number. And look at this, guys. Look at this. The guy's born on the 201st day of the year. July 20th is Gilbert Burns' birthday. Get out of here, yo. Yo, like I said, guys, you could you could take my advice. You don't have to. I'm not really like a sports decoder, but I think I'm gonna lay a hundred bucks on this on this bitch. <laughs> Facts. Yo, look at this. Oh my lord. February 13th, 263 which is the 56th prime number. And I mean, this isn't a crazy find, but it's like, okay, 56 date numerology. Like, what are the odds of that? That's probably a little coincidental. But everything else, I promise you, isn't. Wow. Mind-blowing. All right, that's it. See you.